This is a brief tutorial on how to set up a screen attached to the RCA video jack. First I should note the type of screen I'm using here. This is a 4.3 inch screen with a resolution of 480 by 272. I find this screen more useful to work with than the common 3.5 inch 320 by 240 display due to the increased horizontal space. Connecting the monitor is fairly straightforward. The yellow connector is connected to a male male RCA adapter and then to the Raspberry Pi. The red cable is connected to a standard barrel jack, which in this case is attached to a 9 volt adapter. Most screens state that they work off of 12 volts, though I find 9 volts works fine in this case. There's also a white connector which you can use to connect a second video source if you want. Now all we need to do is plug in the adapter and power the Pi. Pretty easy, but like this the display is difficult to read, so let's change that. After logging on, type in this command to enter into the console configuration. Select UTF-8, then select Guess Optimal Character Set. Choose VGA. Lastly, pick a font size. Let's try 16 by 32. Let's give the Pi a reboot to see how this all looks. We're almost there, but notice that we have a bunch of wasted space with that wide black border, at least mostly at the top and bottom of our screen. Every pixel is precious when using a small display like this, so let's fix that. Use nano to open boot slash config.txt. Here we want to change the overscan value. We can uncomment any of these and then set them ourselves. This is really a matter of trial and error, so I'll see what I can get accomplished here. You can see we now have 14 horizontal lines. Overall, I can say that I'm pleased with this display and I'll most likely use it when I can't use SSH to log into my Pi. Okay, hopefully that was helpful.